All right, new lake, Lake Jessamine. We're here at this uh, little baby boat ramp, the uh, Woodsmere, I think it's Woodmere boat ramp. I think it's the name of the road it's off of. So there it is, it's a big, big beautiful lake. I've tried to find my way in here. I finally cruised around and I found this little boat ramp. So we're gonna get out there and give it a shot. It's a nice, warm, pretty calm day, so fish weren't biting that well yesterday but new day let's give it a shot oh shit oh man that was a bite son of a there's a bite there we go there we go all right, way up under the dock. Got our first bite. Little guy, little skinny guy. We're on the board though. It's something. So maybe that's what we need to do. Plenty of docks on this lake to sling baits under. Um, the watercolor, let me let that guy go watercolor is like pea green soup you can't see anything there's definitely some grass i was throwing a lipless around these lily pad outside edges and coming up with some curly leaf pond weed and some more filamentous grass like a carolina water shield and stuff um but uh we got bit under the dock there's one There's another one. There's another one. All right. Getting a touch bigger. Here we go. Oh, come on, guy. Come on, guy. Come on, guy. Come on, guy. All right. Here we go. Same dock. Little shallower on the dock. Well, could be a glory dock or we're figuring something out. <clears throat> Absolutely hoovered that bait. All right, getting a touch bigger. Let's get a measurement on this guy. Get him back in. Ooh, is that a bite? There's another one. There's another little guy. Another little tiny guy, but we're definitely putting something together. The deepest, darkest, shadiest spots of the docks are, we're getting bit. That's our third fish on the dock, so. Yeah, there's definitely still plenty more docks to flip. Um, there's a point over here I would definitely want to hit and check out, but we're gonna keep going with this pattern as long as, as, long as we have docks to do it. There's another, there's another one. Oh, God, get out of there. Get out of there. There we go. All right, a little better. All right, that's the fourth one. I made a couple repeated flips under this dock. There's only so much area I could put my bait, and uh, I didn't have much hope, but that last one, there's a fish there. All right, just to show you, man, I'm rocking the old weedless neko so we got a nail weight shoved in the front of the senko i put a little dab of glue to hold it in because i'm skipping you know if you're skipping under docks and stuff and banging against stuff that weight will get loose and come out so save a few weights and i got this hook i just kind of basically how i rig it i find the hook slot that is on these uh these are the yum dinger so that's the yum version of the Senko. I go a little above the hook slot and I go straight through the bait right and then I pull it all the way through 
and then the bait has these two little keepers right there so I'm gonna peg the bait like so and then I'm just gonna find the hook slot and bring that hook through it so if you can see the hooks just barely sticking through so I can do that kind of pin it just just right there right there at the top of the hook slot and then when I get bit it'll pop out see so it just helps there's a lot of grass and stuff I got a lightweight 16th ounce is the heaviest I'll go when I'm throwing it into vegetation so it doesn't bog down so there you go that's my little setup for that there we go all right nice there we go another little guy it was on the outskirts of the uh the dock on that guy oh man Ooh. there's one. Oh man he was a little guy he was a little tiny guy there's another one there we go oh come on out of there there we go little guy they are definitely on the docks today I think it is safe to say Big fish though. There's one. There's another one. Oh yeah. Alright. Another dog fish. Okay. Again, not a big one. But there's plenty of fish to be had here. Boy, let that guy go. All right, man. So, you know, we caught some fish. Um, nothing that big. I feel like we got a good gauge representative sample. Caught like seven. Got a few other bites that were smaller fish that kind of uh, got off. And uh, just not, not a healthy... Not a healthy class of fish is what I'm trying to say. So probably write this place off. Might come back another year or two and check it out again. There's plenty of lily pads to flip around and punch that I didn't do. You know, just the docks were the deal. So I just wanted to catch as many fish as I could, get a, get a good idea of what was in this lake. Um, did not see a ton of grass. There was grass. I threw a lipless around and uh, kind of caught some pond weed and stuff like that, but not the good grass that I like to fish around, like hydrilla or eel grass. Um, water was pea green soup, you know, no clarity whatsoever. So it was, it was cool. We caught some fish, but you know, I, I feel like I can check this uh, lake off my list of places to, to, you know, focus on. Anyways, that's what I'm trying to say. So 